Guys, my name is Vishal Kapoor, your friend in real estate. And today I'm here to provide you Milton market update for May 2017. So how's the real estate market did in May? Here are some numbers to provide you some insight. Milton spring market has seen some sudden burst of inventory as every seller wants to sell after holding off to put up in the market for first quarter of the uh, year. January, February, March inventory was low, uh, minus 33.94%, minus 51%, and minus 22.1% compared to last year. Come April and May, we got more inventory compared to last year, we got into positive side, plus 19.65% in April, and huge plus 46.11 in May. Milton got more inventory, uh, more inventory means more choices, listings staying longer in the market, and when more choices are there, it impacts prices. So in composite, May average sales price seen negative growth, minus 2.60% month over month. Means compared to April 2017 prices, but compared to May 2016, still up 24.63%. Now we're going to look a little deeper in terms where prices are dropping. Is it two-story, is it townhouse, or is it condo apartment? So two-story detached home has seen negative growth of minus 3.67%. It's above average than the composite. But year over year, we're still 24.76% up, which means we have gone back to December 2016 and January 2017 prices. Townhouses, on the other hand, still see the increase of 4.63% month over month, year over year up 24.67%, so townhouses prices are still rising in May 2017. We also have seen condo apartment price increase. It has increased to 4.28% month over month. Condo apartment are still up 26.47% year over year. Conclusion, market is changing in terms of how long the listing staying in the market. Uh, it is obvious when more inventory, more choices, it will impact sales. Seller who have patience and their realtor have shared what is happening in the market and they took the decision to drop the price and still get 24.63% um, average increase from last year are happy. And sellers who are started getting panicked, uh, dropping prices. Buyers started holding off by hearing media report that prices will drop more. Uh, I also heard uh, from my mortgage expert friends that bank is getting tougher on approving mortgages. Uh, people were approved for 80% and now bank is willing to give them 70%. So I understand it's tough to make decision. So again, question is when to buy or when to sell? Well, each individual is in different situation getting an advice from realtor who has in-depth market knowledge can definitely help. And I'm here to help. Let me know your thoughts. And if you like this market update, uh, do like and share with your family and uh, friends and they will appreciate it. Uh, thank you for sharing my open market update last time. I got the great response. And if you like market updates uh, or other local real estate news, directly delivered to your email, simply send me an email at wishforyourhome at gmail.com. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.